big incentives for would-be lifeguards. Good evening, I'm Paula Eben. And I'm David Wade. The state has hundreds of positions to fill, but as WBZ's Zania Maldonado shows us, higher pay and bonuses are already drawing in the candidates. Training to save lives. And take control of the arms grabbing. That's what these teens are doing today so they can be out patrolling the beaches this summer. I feel like I'm part of the solution and I'm helping people keeping the pool safe. State officials say after last summer's lifeguard shortage and spike in drownings across Massachusetts, they're bringing new incentives to the table to bring more candidates through the doors. We are offering a $500 bonus to those lifeguards who stay through the summer season as well as a $500 signing bonus. And how about higher wages, the state bumping up the pay 21 to $26 per hour. Of course I was drawn in by the higher wages and signing bonus, yeah, it's going to be great. The pay increase, being a lifeguard and being able to help people, I just can't say no to it. The Somerville YMCA just one of dozens of state partners that provide lifeguard training before they make their way to the state beaches and pools. My dad got me to be a lifeguard and my aunt, they're both lifeguards and they were here at one point. The Department of Conservation and Recreation says they do not anticipate a lifeguard lifeguard shortage this summer thanks to the incentives and a bounce back from the pandemic. It's a much larger pool of candidates than we normally have. But they will still need to fill 600 roles in total. If you're looking for a great way to make money and meet great people and friends, come to be a lifeguard. In Somerville, Zania Maldonado, WBZ News.